y'all, it's Alex and you are watching Peach Perfect. Thanks so much for tuning in. So today I have got a shoe review. So we're gonna be doing a boot and a booty review. So I've gotten two new pairs of shoes in that I'm absolutely in love with, that I've, I'm, I'm, I have other colors in one and I'm going to be getting other colors in the other because I absolutely love them. But before I jump into those details, if you are new to my channel, welcome. I am so happy to have you here. Please subscribe. A lot of awesome videos coming up soon that you don't want to miss out on. Two, I do have an Amazon wish list. So if there is something in particular that you want to see me review or guinea pig, um, just to check out my Amazon account because I've got a lot of awesome things on the wish list and I try to update it as much as I can. And three, I do have a Patreon. So if there is a more exclusive side to me that you want to see, check that out. I post, I've got some crazy hair going on. Um, I've got, I post weekly selfies and weekly exclusive videos that you're not going to find anywhere else, not on my Instagram, not on my YouTube, nowhere else but Patreon. So on to the shoes. I'm going to drop this camera just a hair so you can kind of see more of the shoes than me. So the first pair I am going to show y'all are, oh my gosh, these gorgeous Steve Maddens. So if you've seen my, if you follow me on Instagram, you've already seen me post these, a couple pictures in these shoes. So amazing booties. They've got them in a bunch of different colors. I think they've got like a white and like a camel cognac and a black and then I think they've even got like a leopard print. I really wanted the snake print just because I knew that it would go with everything, but I think I want the leopard and like the camel cognac because that would go with everything because I've already got a pair of black booties that I love. So it's the real deep V. Sorry, I'm making sure I'm getting in the camera. The real deep V on either side, the rounded toe, kind of a blockier heel, a bigger heel than like some of the, the smaller ones that he does. And the thing that I love about these boots is that the heel is the same color. It's not like some, most boots where, you know, there's a pattern on the, on the majority of the shoe and then the heel's like black or, or camel or whatever, it's plain. So I love this about this boot is that the entire thing is that print. So here, so with these, a lot of the people when I was reading reviews were saying they didn't even wear socks or anything. I've just been wearing these like little footies and I got them, um, I think just off of Amazon. They're just the cute little footies um, and they're perfect for it because they don't really show. I think you might be able to see like just the slightest bit right at the bottom, but I don't really care because I don't want, I don't, I just, I'm weird about wearing barefoot and boots and tennis shoes and stuff just because I don't want my feet to get sweaty and nasty and then stink up my shoes and all that. So here are the booties and I just love them and the cool thing about them is that they're actually really comfortable so I've done like a couple mall days in these booties I've had a couple errand days where I went and got my nails done and I did you know a bunch of different things so I had them on like all day and I had no issues and the other thing about these boots is seriously y'all you will get compliments everywhere you go anytime I wear these boots everywhere I go people are stopping me Oh my gosh, where did you get your boots? Who are they by? Where did you get them? How much were they? Are they comfortable? So really, you're going to get lots of compliments. So you can kind of see like what I was saying. You can see the sock like just slightly right on the edge, but I don't even care. Um, and like I said, the deep V on either side. Absolutely gorgeous. Super, super comfortable, especially for like a pair of booties. The one thing that I will say is it kind of took just a little bit. It wasn't bad. But just because I'm not used to something rubbing right on that part of my ankle, I didn't get a blister or anything. It wasn't that bad, but it definitely was just kind of, it almost felt like a little raw. So it might be the sort of thing that the first couple times you wear, just put like a little nude colored band-aid there just to make sure that you don't get a blister. I didn't get one, but I just felt like I could have, I could have if, if, you know, all the circumstances were right and I was wearing them for a long amount of time. But I love them. I definitely think over Black Friday, I'm gonna to try to get a couple more pairs just so I can have more to, to choose from because I just love them, they're so cute. And they go with everything. You know, just an outfit like this, you can kind of dress an outfit up like this just by putting on a pair of the 
little booties like this. So I love them, super comfortable. These, before I lie to y'all, let me make sure I'm telling you the right size. So these are a six. I am typically a five and a half or a six, so they do run true to size. Um, I did not have to size up. Sometimes in boots I size up to a six and a half just if I know I'm gonna wear thick socks, but because I'm not wearing thick socks with these, a six is perfect. So definitely um, good size. All right, so the next pair I'm gonna be talking about are, oh my gosh, these amazing over the knee Mark Fisher boots. So they are a little more on the pricey side, but they hold up so well. They're beautiful. They're so well made. They're so comfortable. So I actually got like kind of like a, a gray tan color like three years, two, two years ago. And that was my first pair of his. It had a bigger heel. I think it had like the two, two and a half inch heel. And so I've been wearing them like crazy. If you follow me on Instagram, you will see so many pictures with me in, the, in those boots. Then last year, I got the black pair with the heel. And I really wanted this, this camel cognac color, but again, since they are a little on the pricey side, I kind of had to space everything out. These randomly were on sale on Nordstrom. I, I've ordered all of mine on Nordstrom. So these were randomly on sale like two or three weeks ago. So the second I saw, I think they're normally like 230, but these were on sale for like a buck 50. So I jumped on it. I love, 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 love Mark Fisher boots. The quality is just amazing. I love all the stitching. I love the detail on everything. So this is the first pair of his that I've gotten with like, that's like a flat, that's the real small heel. And I just felt like I wanted something a little different and they don't offer this color in the heeled color, but I don't need everything with the heel. Um, the other little feature I love is you can kind of see that little gold, that little gold detail on the toe. The toe is pointed. These do run a little small. So with that being said, definitely size up at least a half size. This is a six and a half and I've got a six and a half in all three of my boots that I've got from him. So they definitely do run a little small and I'm not even wearing like super thick socks or anything. Like when I wear these, I typically wear just a real thin, um, you know, mid, mid ankle sock just so that I don't get any um, rubs anywhere from the zipper or anything. But so here are the boots on, I'm just stepping back so you can get the full effect. And again, the cool thing about both of these pairs of shoes that I'm gonna, I'm gonna be reviewing is that you can dress them up. Again, I always go back to versatility and that's what I love because it's the perfect thing that I can just throw on with something like this to kind of dress a pair of jeans and a little Sherpa up or the way I wore them a couple days ago was with you know some jeans and like a bodysuit and like a leather jacket. So you can definitely dress them up or just dress them down, that's what I love. But I love the color, I love the heel, I love the toe, I love how high up they are, because some, some over the knee are like, you know, mid knee, and I think it looks weird. I love that it's truly like, you know, two inches above my knee. Y'all will not be disappointed if you get a pair of Mark Fisher boots. These, like I said, this is my third pair of the over the knees in different colors, and I absolutely adore him. So, but just definitely beware, size up at least a half size, because they definitely do run small. I mean, my toe, is about maybe three fourths of an inch away from the pointed part. And because it's so pointy, you definitely kind of run out of space at the end. So at least a half size up, I've just got super small feet. So I, I definitely can just get away with um, a six and a half. But, so let me raise this back up for a hot second. So yeah. Um, I hope that that was helpful. I hope that y'all enjoyed. I guess I still need to raise that up. It's a little low, but um, I hope that y'all enjoyed. Awesome, awesome, awesome shoes. I am definitely going to be keeping my eyes peeled for both of these on Black Friday just because I think both of them might be a little on sale and that will be the perfect time to get a couple other colors or prints, but love both of them. Super comfortable. The Steve Madden, like I said, true to size, these definitely size up a little bit. Um, very comfortable, super cute. I get lots of compliments since I've gotten them. I've only, I've only had them a couple weeks, but I've gotten lots of compliments every single time I wear them. So, new shoes, 
lots more videos coming, so stay tuned. Like I said, definitely subscribe so you don't miss out. I hope y'all are having a great weekend. And as always, if you want to find me on Instagram, you can do so at my Peach Perfect, and my personal account is Badass Glass. Y'all have a fantastic weekend, and I will see y'all soon. Mwah.